leave my mother. She finds out that she has a grandson, and by noon she has an entire nursery decorated. It's pretty amazing. Yeah, it is. It's just... What is it? I was hoping that you and Danny would, would come home with me. I'm not sure. What are you asking? I'm asking you and Danny to share my life. Just to let me love you and take care of you both. I'm, I'm asking if, you know, if we can be a family. I, I know, I know that you can raise Danny on your own. But you want to take care of us anyway? Because that's who you are, Jason. If you think that somebody needs you, you're going to be there for them. I just, I don't want to be an obligation. You, you're, my, you're my wife. I should have shown you. I, I should have loved you instead of shutting you out. I'm so angry. I was so angry and I kept digging a hole, Jason, and I just, I didn't know how to get back to you. Is that, is that still how you feel? No. No, I'm not angry anymore. I'm just really, really confused. Me too. You remember that story you told me? You know about what our lives would have been like if the baby had survived? Sam, we can, we can have that life you dreamed of. There's nothing in the way. Yes, there is. If you... I'll accept whatever you decide. I just need to know. Is it, is it McBain? No. I mean, I care about him, but he has nothing to do with this. Then who? My son. I love you, Jason, but my son has to be my first priority. Uh, are you afraid that he won't be safe with me? No. No, I know you would protect him with your life. I know that. But my son needs more than that. He needs for you to love him. I do. I've got to ask you something, and I'm, I'm not doing it to punish you, but it's just, it's really important. You said that you were afraid that when you looked at my son, you would always see Franco. I was wrong about that. You were honest. But then on the roof last night, you told Heather that you loved him and you could be his father. Did you say that because you wanted to save him or because you meant it? So I love you. And Danny. Just, I hope it's not too late for you to believe that. He's probably going to be hungry. When he wakes up, I'm gonna go get a bottle. the chance to watch you grow and just be there for you.
father? Do you believe that? Please tell me you're going to be this little baby's father. That's, uh, that's up to Sam. It's up to Sam? If yeah. she lets you go and she deprives this beautiful little okay, boy of your love, she's Carly, 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 cannot fight you for me. You gave her the biggest but... miracle. You found her baby after Heather gave him away. Look at the ear. It wasn't only Heather. What are you talking about? Your friend Todd was involved. Oh. How was Todd involved in all this? <sighs> he was in the woods that night. He took Ted Delgado's baby and went looking for help. Yeah, but it was Heather who switched the Yeah, babies. we're talking to known about it. He could have? Uh, we don't know. The cops are questioning him. You're not going to tell me to stay away from Todd? You're going to do what you want, like always. Okay, well, it's weird, all right? But you and Todd are nothing alike, but you are. How? He doesn't judge me. I tell him all the horrible things I've done, and he doesn't even blink. And the night that I found out the truth about Johnny, I was devastated, and I was humiliated, and I wanted to run straight to you, but your phone kept going to voicemail. I, know, I was right in the middle of the whole kidnapping I get that. Was... I understand that. But I went to Todd, and he let me talk, and he listened, and he let me vent, and he even made me laugh. So if you're telling me now that he's involved in all this, and he's a baby stealer... We don't know that he's guilty yet. Yeah, we don't know he's innocent. You think I'm lying to myself about Todd? I mean, Todd could be lying to you. I mean, you're not you're not trying to convince yourself to feel something you don't feel. No, I no, I I, I like him, I do. I mean, he's my friend almost. What what is what is almost? <laughs> I only have one friend, you know. The person who will never give up on me, no matter how much I deserve it. Who will always catch me when I fall. You don't need me to catch you. You're a very strong woman. That's because I have you to believe in me. I love you. I love you so much. And I want you to be happy. And will you do that, please? Will you be happy with this little baby? Mm. to uh, see your beautiful little boy. <laughs> your mom now. And you need to do the right thing. You need to let Jason be a part of his life. Okay. Sam, I can wait as long as you need.